I'm not happy at all. Look at the situation of things now. Look at my husband is lying down on the sick bed. And these people, AGA, came here to come and be talking what they did not do. How can they come online and be saying that they are supporting the, my husband since, uh, from the beginning? Let me state categorically and again vehemently that AGN has been of help to Mr. Igbo. As an association and as esteemed members of the guild, I'm not talking of those who are not affiliated with the guild who have also made contributions as of two years ago. Let me address the boy, purportedly Mr. Igbo's wife's brother. He mentioned my name at least three times. This is not about me, but to set the record straight. The reason I went there, one, was because of the person involved who I respect and who was instrumental to moving him from the other hospital where he was not receiving adequate care to the, the guild doctor was there medical personnel were there his wife was there my first words to him and i quote what have you done to yourself in his usual jovial manner he smirked he smiled he was in a bit of pain but he was jovial food was brought in he asked for food his wife proceeded to feed him I do not want to go into details of the conversations that we had about the circumstances leading to him being in this critical situation. I know what she said to me. I'm not one to bandy words. I do appreciate the fact that she is at her wit's end, present hospital, whose location I cannot mention. I went there because of the situation anybody would be but to say that AGN light is not true the theatrics was a bit much but it's okay I am not angry we are not angry but I state again categorically that AGN has been of help to Mr. Ibu in the past Members of the guild have been, and I'm not talking about those who are also outside of the guild, because it's freedom of association. I also want to ask Jasmine, his daughter, to please reveal the contents of the message and the voice note she sent to the president, Mr. Emeka Rulas AJZ, on the, what's the date again? 9th of june 2022 the voice note and the message she sent to him profusely thanking him for stepping in for the family at their time of need agn is not a charitable organization it is not a bank it is not a hospital we are not compelled to reveal the inner workings of our guild and our association to members of the public. It is a private association. The best the guild can do is to make sure that members have access to critical information, access to things that will aid their welfare, like the health insurance scheme know about events and activities that will benefit the members, make sure that working conditions are good, and not, and I am not, a court jester to display on social media, to perform in a circus. That is not who I am, that is not who we are. We are a respected guild. Now, it is freedom of association. In a case where someone has a recurring malaise, it is left for you to try and sort yourself out. The guild can only do so much. This is the truth. I don't know of any other association that makes all these things available readily to its members. 
I sympathize with her and how she feels. The critical focus is for Mr. Ibu to get well. And I'm so glad he's getting support from the public. But to come out and cast aspersions, try to smear my name, it's not nice. I value my integrity. I work very hard for my name. And for me to take on this position as the Director of Communications for the Actors Guild, it's something I care about. I care about people. I understand her emotions, but that video was not necessary. I maintain again for the third time that AGN has been of help to Mr. Ibu and his family in the past. The records are there, bank records are there, bank statements are there, donations that were made privately to him, personally to him. I do not want us to carry on throwing mud here and there. It is not nice. I do, do however, recognize that there are people on social media whose stock in trade is to be the purveyor of mischief, denigration of others. I pray that a day will come where you will not be in a situation where you will need help. And the same people whom you have casted as specials on will be the ones you will need their help. Social media is a place to heal, to help, not to drag, to pull down. When the purpose of a thing is not known. Abuse is inevitable. I have no more to say. AGN did not lie. Thank you. I am not happy at all. Look at the situation of things now. Look at my husband is lying down on the sick bed. And these people, AGN came here to come and be talking what they did not do. How can they come online and be saying that they are supporting the, my husband since uh, from the beginning? Why would they come now to say they are supporting him? When they are not, they have not done anything. I can't see them. I myself, I contacted uh, my Emeka uh, rulers. I, I, I sent him a message which he read and did not say, reply it. The message is still there. I called, the, I called him, he did not answer my call. I sent him a message, he, did, he read it and did not reply me. So why now? Why would they come now to come and be uh, blabbing, to come and be talking what they did not say, what they did not do? What kind of a thing is this? I am not happy. I've been suffering since. Been in the hospital for long, taking care of my husband, and now they are coming now to come and be talking what they, they did not do. It was saying what they did not do. This is totally unfair. It's not good. My fellow Nigerians, please, people should put, uh, uh, look into this. It's 